I feel like, you know, some people think I'm not working hard enough, but I feel like I am working hard enough, you know, to really do what I want to do. And that's, you know what I'm saying, just be, just be me in the best way I possibly can, you know, and just to show that to the world. I mean, right now working on this all this on this computer stuff man you know it's it's very it's definitely new <laughs> very definitely it's not i wouldn't say it's all too new to me but it's very a terrain that i'm, that I'm fairly new at you know what i'm saying i really don't know too much about it so i know that you know the quality of right i know the quality is probably not the best right now but you know what i'm saying me as a person, you know, I feel like I have a whole quality. So we're going to get through it, man. It's okay. All right. It's okay. We're going to get through it, man. I'm pretty sure soon after this, man, you know, we'll be, we'll be big. So you got to make what do right now. So that being said, you know, I decided, you know what I'm saying? What would be a good first video? And, you know, man, I just thought I just got off work, man. Let's just say, man, let's just, let's just do a quick tier list, man. Let's do a quick classic tier list video, okay? I say let's do that, all right? Let's do that, all right? So, hey, man, you know what I'm saying? We got some Cartoon Network, man. Man, I'm a big, I'm like a cartoon geek, bro. I love cartoons, bro. I don't care what type of, bro. I love cartoons. Cartoons are my favorite. So let's see, man. You know what I'm saying? We got obviously got a classic tier list, man, from S to F. Well, actually, S to Flash animation. Not <laughs> I'm dead when it said Flash animation, man. So let I mean, let's get this thing popping and locking, man. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Cassie Johnny, uh, Johnny Test. All right, got a hair of fighting hair in a charmer charged backpack. His genius sisters treat him like a lab rat. Man, Johnny Test has a pretty iconic theme song, bro. It's pretty iconic, man. I'm not even going to hold you, man. I think just off that alone, bro, it deserves a high ranking, bro. Just because the, I, the theme song is so iconic, bro. Johnny Tess. Johnny Tess. I just think, bro, Johnny Tess, it, it was, I definitely think it was kind of redundant. They definitely used some of the same things, but Johnny Tess, bro, I think that's a, that's a solid B, man. I can, I can watch, easily watch. Johnny says all day, man, without no problem, man. Shout out to the Netflix show. I mean, I feel like, I don't know, I kind of like the classic style, man. But, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to make what do, man, you know? Johnny says B tier. B tier. Okay, we got another one. Uh, Let's see. Foster's Home. Foster's Home for Imaginary Kids. See, I didn't really watch. I didn't really watch this show like that. It didn't really interest me like that, you know? I, I do think it's definitely, it has some very good things, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to childhood. You know, we all kind of had that uh, that imagination type thing with us, you know what I'm saying? We all kind of did. We all had, you know, imagination, imaginary friends. So I think just, just because of that, just because of the theme, I think I'm going to do, I'm going to do a C tier on that, man. Definitely a C tier. Now, whew, man, there's some good shows in here, man. God dang, this is a good list, man. This is a good list. <laughs> Bro, all right, come on. Okay, let's get into it. Let's get into it. Cow and chicken. Mama had a kid chicken. Mama had a cow. It's good. No, how? Now, cow and chicken. I think, bro, this is one of these shows that used to come on Boomerang. All right, late at night, man. I'm a night owl, bro. I stay up. I stay up all the time, bro. Night owl, bro. I think cow and chicken, man. It's a good C tier, man. I think it, it kept my attention, man, until, until I went to sleep. I think that's the C tier over. I'll watch this over Foster's American Kids, man. Foster's not imaginary kids, but you know what I'm trying to say. But um, let's see. Flapjack? Now, Flapjack is just such a, a new, such a unique show, man. Very unique. I don't really think anybody, any other show has that same premise like that Flapjack has, man. And it's also very creepy, too, dude. So creepy, man. At the same time, but the art style is just so, so. Oh my god, you make your skin crawl, especially them close-ups with the oh, that with the close-up. 
Bro, that joke, it just does something to you, man. You know what I'm saying? I do like Flapjack. The misadventures of Flapjack. I would definitely watch this over Johnny Test, man. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Uh, you take the moon and you take the sun. You take everything that seems like fun. You stir it all up and when you're done. Rada, 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 rada. Come on, man, bro. This is child, bro. A tier, man. Do I see really the same thing, bro? It's about a kid that just loves food, bro, and, lo and wants to learn how to cook, man. I feel like cooking is a very, is a skill that I feel like everybody needs to know how to, needs to learn. You have to learn how to, how to make your own meals. When you make your own meals, it's so much more satisfying, bro. I don't really know what to say to that. Say to that, like... Bro, you got to make your own meals, man. You got to, bro. China, you know what I'm saying? Chowder definitely taught us that, man, you know? Now, my gym school is a teenager, is a, is a monkey, whatever this is. I don't really, man, D, I didn't even really watch that show. I did play the video game. The video game was pretty fun, though. On Cartoon Network, on the Cartoon Network, uh, Cartoon Network, uh, website, it was definitely fun. I think I only played the video game. That was pretty much it, but, um. Duck, whatever this is. I don't even know what that is, man. So I guess it's gonna have to go into the editor by default, man. I'm not even gonna hold you. Johnny Bravo, Johnny Bravo, he was just that man. He was just the epitome of just being persistent with these women, man. Cause these women, man, they hey man. Johnny Bravo didn't care, man. Hey, how you doing, mama? He didn't care, bro. He was gonna get he was gonna get him a piece, man. Best believe that. It don't matter, bro. And he don't care. I never really know why 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 they why the women didn't want Johnny Bro man. He's really that guy, bro. He got the style. You know what I'm saying? Black shirt, blue, blue, blue jeans, black shoes. You can't go wrong with that, man. Simple style that the shades on. He's he's swole. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, them, them ladies was with them ladies was, man. Them late, man. Jimmy Kyle like Johnny Bro, man. I'm gonna give him a B, man. I'll probably will give it at the end, yeah. I would probably, yeah. Johnny Bro was a B. Gotta love Johnny Bro, man. Ooh, man, we get, ooh, my God, that's a lot of good shows, man. Whew. Uh, I don't even know what this is, so that's just going into the elf. I don't even know what that is, <laughs> to be honest. Now, Garfield show, Garfield show, whew. Now, for some reason, I don't know why they had so many reruns of the Garfield show. Garfield is not really one of my favorite cats, but... I think this show definitely has some significance. You know what I'm saying? The voice acting was good. You know, they had that iconic voice. So I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do D. I think I will watch Garfield's show over I don't know, man. Garfield kinda, I don't know. It's a cat that eats lasagna, man, you know. I don't know, man. Uh, okay, Curse like, since my you know mouth is over at Curse of Cali Dog. Now this show This show is one of them, is 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 a, is who is one of them shows, man. This show was so creepy, bro. It's crazy how, you know what I'm saying, animation back in the day, man, cartoon back in the day, they, they was a lot more unique, I would say, man, very, you know what I'm saying, I feel like, definitely, it, it had, it was a show for everybody, man, you know what I'm saying, so, Chris Cowley Dog, man, definitely one of those shows, you know, I, it was always funny how he used to get abused by his owner, stupid dog, you know, he get beat, man, even though he tried to save it, their lives, man, I think, Chris Cowley Dog, he's one of them, man, he, he he's that nigga, man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him a beat. I think I will watch Curse of Cali Dog over these shows right here. I'm going to give him a B. You know what I'm saying? He didn't really have that many episodes either, so yeah, I'll give him a B. Uh, let's see what's next. Let's see what's next. Camp Laszlo. Uh, I'm not going to be I'm gonna be honest, man. I didn't really watch this show like that either. I feel like... I don't know, man. I do like the art style. I think I'm going to give it a... I think I'm gonna get right in the middle of the D, man. I'm gonna get it with a D. <sighs> I think I'm gonna get it with a D, man. Yeah, I feel like that's where it, that's where it is. I don't really people don't really talk about Camp Lazo like that, unless it, unless they're just like super nostalgic. But yeah, man, I think that's yeah. I think I'm, I think it deserves a D. You know what I'm saying? Not too bad, but I mean, I never really watched it, so I mean, I guess you know. Yeah, but anyway, Whew. Symbiotic Titan, bro. This show needs a new season, bro. Why did they stop this show, bro? Kravinsky, John Kravinsky, whatever it is, bro. He is a genius when it comes to cartoons, bro. S tier, bro. It even finishes. It's an amazing story, bro. It had an amazing story. Great animation. Great characters. Like, Lance, Elena, come on, bro. Come on, man. The robot, I'm so... And he's the heart of the show. I don't know why I can't remember his name for some reason, man. Octus. 
Come on, man. Great show, man. S tier, bro. I wish I could give it a higher score, man. S tier, bro. S tier. Come on, man. Total Drama, bro. Total Drama Island is just, it's an iconic, just iconic, bro. What can I say? Total Drama Island is really that show, man. And it's just so, it was so realistic, man. It was so, I feel like it could be a real, like a real life TV show. Like, it were real characters. That's how, they had great characters, man. It was so believable, man. It was like, it was so, oh my God. Total Drama Island, man. I wanna be, I wanna be, I wanna be famous. I don't know why I can't remember the rest of the theme song, man. I'm, I feel so bad. Like, cause I sing this, I sing that theme song all the time, bro. But anyway, man, S tier, bro. S tier, bro. I give it a new season, man. Shit, add me in. I wanna be a voice actor. Add me in the show. You know what I'm saying? Scooby Doo Mystery Incorporated. Now, this is probably besides what's new Scooby Doo. This this comes this is a close second to what's new Scooby Doo. It but you know what I'm saying you can't beat the theme song. What's new Scooby Doo? We're coming after you. We're gonna start that mystery. It just has that, bro. It just it just has that nostalgic ass rock. I love rock star. I love rock music, bro. It, it has that nostalgic ass rock star song. You can't beat that, man. So I'm gonna give it an A, man. Right right behind what's new Scooby Doo, man. Right just by this, man. Space Ghost, Flash Animation. Who the fuck watch? Nobody watches that, man. Who talks about that? Who talks about that? Generator X, bro. S tier. Needs new season. Need, need somebody, some A, man. Cartoon. I don't know what y'all doing. Cartoon. Y'all just ruined. Y'all don't know what's up with y'all. Canceling these amazing shows. You did it with Symbiotic Titan. You did it with Generator X. Like, what are you doing? What are you doing, bro? Give us what we want, man. Give us what hashtag bring back Generator X. Damn. Looney Tunes show. Now, Looney Tunes show, I do like the one. I like the art style. I do like how it's more of a realistic setting, realistic plot. We're not, it didn't really have a plot, but realistic stories. I do like Looney Tunes show, so I would give it a C plus on that. Batman Beyond, man. That's just an S tier, bro. Even though I didn't watch so many, those so many cartoons, I, even though I didn't watch a lot of Batman Beyond, my guy, the costume, bro, it just does it for me. It's so clean. It has to have an S tier, man. It's S tier, bro. I mean, it's what a gumball. S tier. Come on, stop playing with me. S tier. S tier. Come on, bro. Stop playing with me, man. Gumball, but you know that you know what's up, bro. You know what's up with Gumball, bro. I'm mean, sadly, it's not. It might not come up with his movie, I think. But come, I don't know what I don't know what they're doing, bro. Hero, Hero 108. Now I do have some memories of this show. I do have some memories of this show. The dude, you know, what I'm saying with the pole. I didn't really understand. Their powers really? I didn't really watch the show like that, you know. And it got canceled really quick. But um, I would give it a D, man. I will, I will, I'll rather watch Hero One Hundred Eight besides these shows right here on the D list, man. The Baboon got I am Weasel. Now I am Weasel. Now that's just nostalgic, bro. You can't. I mean, <laughs> I will put it at the uh, bro. I will put it at this, bro. That's a C, bro. It's just I am Weasel. It just come on, bro. You know, so you feel bad for the bad bone, especially with that red ass. Like, I mean, you feel bad for him, man. But, you know what I'm saying? It's whatever. Infinity Train. Now, Infinity Train. But it's, Infinity Train is kind of a mystery show, man. Like, it, it didn't really premiere. I don't think it really premiered on cable. You really have to watch it on HBO. That's 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 how I, I was able to watch it. But, um, Infinity Train, I, I would say it's an A, man. I think, I think it has it. The first season, it was definitely, I didn't really like how it. Did I like how it ended? I, I like I like Infinity Train. I'll give it a. That's what I'm gonna say. Justice League, just for nostalgic purposes, man. S tier, bro. You can't. S tier, you, you can't beat that, man. I would say. Hold on, let me. I would watch. Yeah, this is how I would do it. Just for nostalgic reasons, man. Come on, it's Justice League, bro. We all love Justice League. Now, Conan Kid Next Door. Now, I didn't watch a lot. Of, I wasn't the biggest fan, but I do like Conan Kid Next. Code name Kid Next Door. You know, it just it was just it was a, it had a great story, man, about kids, you know, just being kids, man, you know, and how kids can really almost pretty much take over the world they really wanted to. Kids can really take over the world they wanted to, man. Kids are the future. We are the young, the young. We we are the future. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I had a great story. So I'm I'm gonna put it I'm gonna put it at B. I want to say I will watch this behind right after Johnny Test. Yes.
Yeah, that sounds about right. Benton, S, come on, bro. Stop, stop playing with me, bro. It's Benton. Come on, man. It's Benton, bro. Don't really need any Benton. All the Bentons. All the Bentons. Even even the little kitty one that they got out now. All the Bentons. It started when an alien device did what it did. It stuck up on upon his reason with secrets that it hid. Now he's got superpowers. He's no ordinary kid. He's Benton. Come on, bro. Iconic, bro. <sighs> now, over the garden wall. Over the garden wall holds a very special place in my heart. It's a, it's just a, it's just the one of the most perfect shows. It's just a perfect show, man. Over the garden wall is a perfect show. It's unique. It's creepy. It's funny. It's innocent. It's all these things, man. The, the creator, I forgot his name. The creator did a really good show, I, I, and it's sad that we may not get a sequel or of any kind. But for what it was, man, it was a great show. I watch it every fall. I'm, I'm gonna watch it. It's gonna be fall now. I watch it every fall. I love the music. I love the premise. This old creepy whims whimsical vibe. The beast is hor is horrifying, man. Great villain. It was a good show with good themes, man. The fear of the unknown, man. I feel like that's one of the biggest fears that we have is the unknown. You know what I'm saying? Just being, you know what I'm saying? Being ignorant is is something to the unknown, bro. You know what I'm saying? You look into the dark abyss, man. You don't know what's in the dark abyss, man. You don't know what could be lurking. But yeah, man, Garvey Garden Wall. That's just that was a special place in my heart, man. Dexter's Laboratory. Day Day, stop fucking with me, Day Day. I'm trying to do my experiments. You know, deep, man. Dexter's Laboratory is just one of those. <sighs> this laboratory, man. I would give it. I would give it a C. I didn't watch it all the time. It it wasn't the show I would frequently watch, but it it is a cool show, man. I can see why people. I can. If, if people would say this this is their favorite show, I can understand why. I can understand why. Now, Steven Universe. We are the crystal gems. We'll always find a way. And if you think we can't, we'll always find a way. I probably sound that wrong, but come on, you know Steven. Steven Universe is is Rebecca Sugar. Like, I love you, but Rebecca Sugar. I know you're married, but I love you, man. You you were you were just a beautiful soul. I love how calm and quiet and intelligent you are. I love the way you're very talented, man. And I'm glad that you was able to, to make something like this. Steven Universe is a, is a beautiful show about a boy just learning to be himself and learning to take on the world, man. The world it would not is the world is not always your friend, man. You was not always your friend, bro. But Steven Universe, man, is just one of those shows, man. The the music excellent. The only thing I didn't like about I didn't like how Steven was such a bitch, man. I didn't like. <laughs> I don't like how I wish Steven Universe. I wish Steven, Steven Universe. I wish Steven had more of a backbone. You know, he's young. He's very sensitive. I know. I and I see myself in him. I'm I'm very sensitive myself. But dude, you're a diamond, bro. You have the power of a diamond. Like, bro. I, I know, and granted, he was still learning him. He was still learning how to use those powers, but. I wish he had, I wish he just wasn't, I just, I don't know. I just wish I didn't see him. I mean, I don't know, man. He's a great character, though, man. Great character, great voice actor, man. I know you're, I know the voice actor, I forget his name, but, you know, he, he he's taking a step down from acting, just focusing on his mental health, you know, God bless him or whatever, you know. Steam Universe is a beautiful show. Right behind, I would say, yeah, in this order. Yeah. Steam Universe is a beautiful show. Nah, if I got over the garden wall, bro. Nah, Steam Universe, I'm just playing. Now, the Grim Adventure of Billy and Man. Billy is just a freaking spit. Like, he's just hilarious, bro. I'm gonna just give that an A. Just because of Billy. Billy Billy carries the show, man. He carries the show, man. <laughs> now, bro. Powerpuff Girls. I'm gonna get that. The original, I'm gonna get that an A. Could they just, they, bro. The original show, bro. They didn't, but Power the Powerpuff Girls did not play about fighting crime, bro. They would beat you to sleep, man. Dead for real. They wouldn't, bro. Bruh. Bruh. I think I would watch. It would go Chowder, Powerpuff Girls, Scooby Doo, Infinity Train. Yeah. Powerpuff Girls is that show, man. Iconic. Kravinsky, John Kravinsky, man. He has so many, he has so many good shows, man. Okay. Regular show. Regular show, man. It's just iconic, bro. I'll say it's one of the few Cartoon Network shows that's one of that's one of Emmy. 
S tier, obviously, over Steven Universe any day of the week. I, I still watch regular show to this day. I get the I get the joke. Now that I'm older, I get all the jokes. It's hilarious, bro. Uh, uh, I was finished. JG Quintel, great guy. I'm sadly, you know, he made another show close enough. Great show. Sadly, they canceled it for so whatever reason. You know, these businesses just be killing me. But great show, man. Great show. Good job. Sam, watch your back. Huh? And I've had Samurai Jack Jack. Samurai Jack Ater. Almost an S, but I didn't really. It's almost an S. I would say it's an A plus. I suppose about this close, but it's an A tier, man. Especially that last season, great last season. You know what I'm saying? A tier. Samurai Jack is is a very good show. And we're gonna save him for last. When there's trouble, you know who to call. T Titans, man. T Titans, man. I love the theme song, bro. I used to binge this shit. I used to binge this when I was younger, bro. Teen Titans, great show. I would say it was a B. B plus. Actually, you know... Actually, that's a lot. Actually, actually, you know what? It's A. It's A. It's A. Okay. It's A. Great art style. Great, great show. Def I think I'm gonna watch it over Samurai Jack. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Secret Saturday, man. Now this is just a this is just so under this is just an underrated show. Secret Saturday is underrated, man. I really feel like you know it didn't really. I love the episode with with uh, Ben Ten, the the uh the crossover episode. Secret Saturdays, I feel like it didn't. I didn't. I wasn't really. I don't really know the premise to really give it a solid rating. I'm gonna. Get, I think I'm gonna give it a C plus, man. It's very underrated. I feel like you know what I'm saying if I I need to go back and watch it just really see how it was. But I, Secret Saturdays, good show. Like begins after school, then when you break all the rules, in the place where we belong. <laughs> 16, man, underrated show, man, underrated. Gotta give it a C, man, C+. Plus. Young Justice, man. <sighs> just because I played the video game, and I played, just because I played the video game, I'm gonna give it a B+. Plus. Yeah. Just because of B+. Plus. Ed and Eddie. I don't really watch it and Eddie, man. I don't even know. I, I'm y'all might be mad at me for this one, man, but I'm gonna have to give it a D, man. I never really like Ed and Eddie like that. Clone Wars. I'm not a big fan of. I'm not a big fan of Star Wars, man. I'm not. That's gonna have to go into C two, man. It was just one episode where it was like this parasite episode, and they and this parasite used to go in their ear, bro. That shit, bro. That episode creeped me out, bro. Creepy ass episode, man. So I'm gonna think. That's how we do it, man. Now, here's one, man. Adventure Time, bro. I still watch Adventure Time to this day, man. I'm still learning lessons from Adventure Time, bro. Adventure Time is just one of those shows, man, that I, that's, I just feel that that just is just timeless, man. S tier, bro. S tier, bro. It just has to be, man. It has to be. And, like, well, that's that's my that's my rating, man. First video, man. That's just, yeah, man. I love cartoons, man. Adventure Time, bro. You're the best. I'm, I can't wait for the for the new show to come out with Shermie and and Beth. Like, I'm just waiting because that's that world is just so unique. So, yeah, man. That's my tier list, man. Thanks for watching. Oh, uh, Ragaroll. Ah.